here we have a video flip through. This is Mary Kay Kay's Artful Journey. And I'm currently working on this for a friend of mine. And she'll be receiving that soon. And I just been making different pockets and adding different fold overs and other stuff. And it still has a story in it. And then there's tucks here, little pockets, pockets everywhere, pockets everywhere. Tickets in the pockets and ta and other stuff, fun stuff in the belly band, and lots of different fun things. And she'll be getting this soon. So I'm working on this, trying to get it prepared for her. She's going to love it when she gets it, that's for sure. A lot of fun stuff in it. And even pocket full of goodies. So, still a few more things to do to it, and got to get a closure, and then it'll be done. And I have another friend who I am working on another journal. This is that burlap one that I did, and she wants a hummingbird journal. So, I've just put the pages all in for her, and now I've got to decorate it. So... Those are my two journals that I'm working on. Um, so today, on this one, we're going to cut this out and add it to the journal. But just to show you this, it has a little lace. Oh, there's a little lace there on that and a little lace here. And this one's a tuck spot. So that'll be a nice little tuck spot. I love, I love running my fingers through the journal before it's done. It's just so cool. And there's that hummingbird there. And sorry for the lighting. I tried to get a new light in here. See if I can get it better. So, and she also likes ladybugs. So I got ladybugs in there. And then here's a little tech spot. It just comes out. You well, know, it does. Or maybe it's just a pretty backing. No, it comes out. And this opens up like this, and there's a tag on this side and writing space there. So that just flips over, and then you just put your paper clip on it. Or your specialty paper clip if you've made one. So that's cool. So that's. That's my second journal that I'm working on. And then I have another journal. Of course, I have the two journals that I had been working on. Um, and I have this Christmas journal that I have to sew, stitch in the, the stuff and make. So those are my journals that I'm in the process of making. And pretty soon I'll be able to show you something new. Um, lately, my camera hasn't, of course, been working correctly, so that's no fun. So, but let's, let's take a look at this one and see what kind of things that I have for this. So, there's a, some Christmas stuff there, and there's an envelope, and then I found this. Somebody sent me some Happy Mail, and that was in it. And there's this. And then there's, I have these stickers. They're like the 12 days of Christmas, so I thought I might do something with that. And I have a Mad Libs, Christmas Fun Mad Libs. 
Santa Claus. And here's some of the signature paper. Oh, there's another piece of that ribbon I can use. And then I have this signature paper that I've collected to put in. And then here's a Christmas card, another Christmas card that I'm gonna incorporate. And I thought that angel would be good in there. And there's this, I'm gonna incorporate that somehow. It's a sack, but it has like a pocket here and a pocket here and a little book on the side. So I'll incorporate that into our thing and fill it with goodies. I'll probably put it as like, you know, a fun gift to add to it. But it's gonna be a one signature journal. So these are the pages that I need to sew in. So let's see, let's do that right now. Let's get those ready to sew in. So let's see here. And I am, I, I thought I was going to cut these up. Well, maybe I'll just cut those out. And then, oh, here's some more stuff that I've been collecting. They're like snow pictures. So everything with a look with snow on them. And then my friend sent me this Christmas card, which I'm going to put at this shaker card in there too. And that was from last year. And then my other friend sent me this Christmas card. And then I made this and it's a envelope. So it'll go, it should go in here like this. Well, I kind of want to do it this way. So it might be a flip up. I'll do it as a, a flip up. So, and then here's some other pages here. So, cause I wanted to add these into it. So I'll just incorporate these here. And we'll go through and see where we can incorporate another one. And we want to make sure that it's upside right. So, cause that's the, there. So now it's upside right. There's some of those I was cutting out. Uh, let's see, there's the sack in there. So I'll cut the end of the sack so that it'll be another pocket. And there's an envelope, another envelope. Have some writing paper. No, um, I know, just some paper. So we're gonna put what are we putting in here? Oh, another. Okay, here we go. Put it in here. Put this in here. Like that. And all I used this was like a big dictionary page and folded it in half. Or or maybe a oh it looks like a piece of cardstock. I fold it in half and add those to the pages. So I'm going to add another one here. Right here. Actually, I'm going to do it inside here. So we'll do it like that. And then we'll open this up. Like this. And this is where our signature middle is so i'm just gonna push that stuff down and clip that together so that'll stay together and then i have to um make the oh here's another clip paper clip thing but i have to open the book where's the book here's the book and it's going to be only a one signature thing. So this is going to go inside here like this. So, so what I'm going to do is find the middle. Let me just see how far it is here. So it looks like we have about six more minutes. I know I keep covering up the light. <laughs> So we want to see where the center is. 
So it looks it's like it's about five. So we'll put a uh, mark there. I have a pencil here. Put a mark right on the five. And then we'll go 2.5 here. Well, actually, I like to do an inch from the edge. So I'll do one and a half inches from the edge. And one and a half inches from the edge. That's pretty, that's good. That way we're getting all of the pieces. So, so in the next video, I'll show you um, it with the signature sewn in. Because there's other videos that I'll link on my video where it shows how I do the, the stitch to stitch in the binding of the journal. So have a blessed day and thank you for being a part of my journey. Bye.